So ito na nga. <coughs> uh, eh, Kada ko tama. 1969 po. Uh, pinanganak ko ako noon. <laughs> so wala pa ako alam sa mga nangyayari noon. Um, so... Um, <laughs> hindi ka maalam lang. <laughs> wala ko nga. Hindi. Um, di ba dami ito maganda ito? Um, puro ang... Um, ang um, 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 ka dyan. Ganto lang yan. Um, in 84, uh, pumasok po ako bilang uh, isang uh, artista at uh, nagawa ko po ang pili ko ng baguets. And um, naging napakaganda po ng pasok ko sa industriya. Pagkatapos ng Hot Shots, Campus B. And then lahat nun, uh, bumagsak na ako. Uh, sa mga hindi po nakakaalam, in 84, 85, 86, I was there. My first time I was 14 years old. 15, 16, and then ito na uh, bilang binata na uh, nakaradan ng kasikatan. Ako po ay uh, nagrebelde. Uh, kala ko walang katapusan ng kaya ang buhay noon ang uh, pag-aalisan na sa ako ay nawala na nawala. So I was doing movies left and right. So so lang, Regal was there of course, si Mother Lee was, was helping me out. And uh, ang nag-handle po ng mga press ko ng Sita Ethel all the time. And uh, Pinaka-ayong gawin sa buhay ko nung ay umatend ng Prescon. In uh, that time, in right, the 80s, late 80s, until si Tita Etong Toys Termin, ano ka ba? Dumating ka pa, di ba? Dumating ka pa, gano'n yun. Kasi dumating ako parang patapos na. Or sometimes, most of the time, hindi po ako dumarating. So fast forward po, in 1990, I made a big decision in my life and I said, parang hindi ako ito lang. Parang I'm, I'm bigger than, than what I am at that point. And uh, I met God. I met our Father, and um, and this is what happened. Tita Ethel Ramos, the pina tao po ng tatay ko, pumunta po sa bahay namin yan sa New York, papa sa New York ko ba? Pumunta siya doon. Sabi aga, sabi ni papa ko. Eto ang kinangan mo, Ethel Ramos. Yun ka, nineteen, twenty years old, like. Prescon, 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 ano mga nangyayari sa akin dyan, di ba? Parang, ito, kailangan mo ganyan-ganyan because your career is wala na, and ganyan, ganyan, ganyan. So long story, hindi ko maintindihan. I even told it, Ethel, kasi nainis ako sa tatay ko, pinapakailaman ako at the time. And, um, di ba, parang gano'n, pagbata ka, uh, you know, nakikilang magulong parang nainis ka. Anyway, um, sinabi ko sa kanya, Ethel, pwede ko ba tayo mag-meet bukas po sa Pisto Lorenzo? Sa bistro, sabi niya nakaupo na siya, okay, sige, I'll be there one o'clock. If you're one minute late, forget about it. <laughs> so I was so sure, so I made sure, kasi sabi niya, alam niya na late ako, so dumating ako alam una, nag-usap kami hanggang gabi. Ito lang ang, 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 uh, ang pinag-usapan namin, marami, pero sinabi niya lang, itong tanong na to talaga, ang hindi ko makakalimutan. Ang tinan niya sa akin, after all, Tuk sumang kwento namin, sabi niya, Are you ready for the big time? Ayan lang niya sa akin yun. And I'm like, Ano yung ibig sabihin naman, are you ready for the big time? Who doesn't want to be big time? It's like, of course, do you know what it entails to be? To be in that league? Whatever it is, I'm ready for it. So it started just like that. And I would say, again, the rest, I guess, is history. Ngayon ko lang na-realize how, how big she is and she was. Um, because the whole time, she covered me. She shielded me from, from everything, you know? From what was happening. Tita Ethel and I had this relationship that no one will ever know. What we talked about all the time, what we would talk about, how we would plan things, lahat ng sakit, dinaanan ko dyan. Ang hirap kung paano niya ako minolde talaga dahil matigas ang ulo ko talaga. But I had aspirations, I had big dreams, and she saw that in me. I minolde niya talaga ako. It was really hard for me. Plus, but I saw results. I was seeing results every year, every year, every year. I was just getting, uh, if I may have to say, no? but I was just making big, really big. And, um, and she said, Aga, We're going for the big time, all the way. Ganun kami ang gusto niyan. 
but I did realize that she, she really shielded me from from all of you. Because I didn't know that I was in my life. I was in my life. I was in my life. The whole time it was just me. Because every time we talked, it was just about me and no one else. She wouldn't tell me what's happening in her personal life, in her life. But we saved. We, we worked hard. She wanted me to save and save and save because the point is, Aga, one day you'll get old and you're going to be tired. But when you don't have you cannot say no to work. And um, so, I remember now, because the past years now, when you're tired, you're tired because you're tired. Puto puto yung sinasabi ko dahil sa lahat ng tulong na naigawa niya para sa akin. I, I am forever grateful. Whoever I am, whatever I have, my wife, my kids, is all because of Tita That's true. I worked. I did. But she was my wings talaga. She, she did it for me. Parang... But it was hard. Ang hirap para sa akin ng una when I was younger. But when I got older, that's when I realized, my goodness, so selfless. All she thought was about was just about me. Puro sa akin lang. Paano ako sisika? Paano ako yayaman? Paano ako titino? At para makahanap ng napakahusay at napakabait na asawa. You know, and... Um, <laughs> Uh, really, if, uh, if, if not for Tita Ethel talaga, um, sinasabi nga na iba, hindi aga, you work also, ikaw yun. Yeah, ako yun ang tapapapaw, but kung walang guidance niya, wala na ako talaga, wala na rin. So, uh, I owe it to you, Tita Ethel, and, um, and, um, and uh, I, I, I did not, I refused to see her in her last uh, years, you know, so, parang, uh, my wife would always tell me, hey, go visit, go visit. Sabi ko, um, parang, uh, <clears throat> it'll be hard for you guys to understand what we, <laughs> what we have for the 30 plus years together. Oh my goodness. When, when I saw her, one picture, when it came out, I was like, what the? Why? 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 I, I question for what time? Why? Why? And then, ang ganda na sinabi ni Ed Kalina, uh, you know, she did not suffer really. Uh, binigyan siya ng pagkakataon ng Panginoon na para mag-settle down, para makita ng lahat ng tao, para mapuntaan siya, mabisita isa-isa. Tita Chit, you're awesome. Thank you very much also. You did so much for me. And Tita Ethel, Tita Len, yes. Of course, I look up with Tita Nell, salamat din sa iyo. Uh, sa mga anak niyo, kay uh, Farah, kay Patty, mga kong, kay Mapa, si Joe, lahat kayo, no? Um, si Tita Ethel would always tell me all the time, lahat na kinikita namin, lahat na kikitain niya, ang iniisip niya parati makapamangkin niya. It's all about you guys. Puro sa iyo yan. Sa inyo yan, lahat ng naipunda rin yan kasi wala naman siya pamilya kundi kayo, kayo mga anak niya, mga pamangkin niya, sobra. Lani, I wanna thank you also, and Senator Bong, maraming salamat sa mga panahon na wala ako, hindi kayo tumigil untong kayo. Pasensya na kayo sa kahinaan ko. At, uh, Tita Ethel knows, you know, our secrets, alam namin lahat yan, pati kay FPJ, Tita Aster, kung hindi nasabi sa akin yun, Ako rin naman lahat ng sikreto ko, alam niya. Mabuti pala na, tayimik. Salamat ito, Ethel, for the protection. At sa inyong lahat, maraming maraming salamat. I just want to end this right. I want to end this right. Sinabi siya rin dito, Ethel, bago mag-pandemia, you're okay na aga. Parang kaya mo na. Uh, fly, you know, fly, fly. But Tita Ethel, sa ano gawin? You, you will always be my, my nana, you know? Um, I will always be here. And I've always been there. One thing I can really say 
sa inyong lahat is I loved her when she was alive. I loved her when she needed it. I gave her the respect that she deserved. And she did the same to me and for me. So, yeah, there's nothing really I can say, but maraming maraming salamat. It says sa inyong lahat, she loved all of you. All she did was give and give and give and give. So, it had a rest. You rest in peace, really. Um, Pagdasal mo na lang kami lahat dito. We're okay naman. So, again, maraming salamat sa inyong lahat. Thank you. Thank you, Patty, uh, Farah. Pag-aasikas ng map. Salamat. And, uh, to then. To shit. Taks lang. Hindi ko kumawala sa inyo. The boys, sa inyong lahat, huwag ka pa din na dito lang po ko. Pero kasi na ito mula tayo. for giving us the chance to peek into the special relationship that we